Yo, trade deadline, and yesterday I got smoked. I ain't gonna lie. It hit me across the head. I post up all types of parlays and shit out of nowhere that I ne never do. Like, mm -mm. that was crazy as hell, man. Like, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you'll be notified. Upload. Um, you'll see me using Outlier today. Um, that, they sponsor my channel, so uh, if you want to uh, get with them, you know, there's a link in my description. Uh, I'm going to start a free week child using my link. If you like it, move forward. Of course, I get a kickback. Um, brutal day yesterday, man. A uh, few, few bright spots, but I lost a lot of straights, man. I lost a lot of straights, man. I lost a lot of shit. Either way it go, uh, bounce back is real. Um, we do have the trade deadline. I'm just getting in from work, really. I'm tired, man. So I'm going to just go through here. I'll let you know what's official, what's not. So you guys can get on with your day. I don't want to hold you guys, right? Um, first game on the docket, what do we have? First game on the docket, we have the Golden State Warriors and the Indiana Pacers. Uh, the t we got some trades already. Uh, we got uh, Kelly Olenek, um, Akbaji. They gone to the to the to uh to the Raptors, man. For Otto Porter. They had the first round pick. Hmm. Interesting. Hmm. Sixes, a buddy here gone. To Sixes. That's interesting. Very interesting, right? And Miles Bridges, he won't approve any trades. We'll remain with the Hornets for the rest of the season, right? So I gotta figure out his motive, right? <laughs> Either way it go, though, we'll see, man. He, he went out there and bust ass last night. Fucked up a lot of people. Harley. <laughs> that man was out there. Yeah. All right, so look. Um, Now that we know Buddy Hill is not in the fold, I, I don't know, really, man, truthfully. Um, man, we got a 249 over under in this one here. I'm going to go in there and find me a bankroll builder somewhere. I, I got a love for Miles Turner in this spot, though, man. Really, man. I do got love for Miles Turner in this spot. I don't know how I want to attack it, but I got love for Miles Turner in this spot. Uh, I'd imagine Draymond Green would get um I imagine Draymond Green would get Pascal Siakam. And hmm. I would have interest in Draymond Green's assist prop as well, right? <laughs> so um looking over to this game, uh Draymond Green assists. I mean, he's just, he is who he is, right? So, uh, his, his sis props sitting at five and a half. Um, he's hit this number of six of his last 10 games. So, there you have that, right? So, I, I'll be looking at Draymond Green there. Um, you can look at his rebounds plus assists, but I ain't messing with the rebounds versus this team. You know, this Indiana team, it's just too many shots go in. Shit. So, you know, it is what it is, right? Um, Miles Turner. Um, points. I think that is points. He's like 17 and a half. I don't know if I'll get there, but he's definitely a candidate to get there. Head to head versus this team they played uh, last year. He played them last year. He had 21 points, but... Um, I do, I do like, I do like uh, Miles Turner here, right? Um, let me see. Yeah, I do like, I, lo I do like uh, Miles Turner there. Uh, this, this, this Golden State team is giving up points to the center, right? Um, they top ten and giving up points to the center, right? So it is what it is. Um, he will step out and hit the three as well. Um, his three ball is sitting at. Uh, let's see where his three ball is sitting at. Sitting at one and a half. He's hit this number four out of his last 10 games. That time they, they played last year, he hit two, right? So let me keep it moving. Um, San Antonio Spurs and Orlando Magic. Um, it's a few things I can like about this game. Um, I was leaning towards the over. Um, I was leaning towards the over uh, rebounds and assists or just the assists for uh, uh, um, Wagner at a parlay piece at three and a half. Uh, so I can talk you off of that. Um, if it ain't broken, I just I, I just not gonna fix it. I'm gonna keep the team just take the points, man. Give me the over uh 12 and a half uh, points for Wendell Carter. 
I'm going to have to just go out on a limb and say it's an official play. It's low. Last time these two teams played, he was pussy, pussy footing around, but he ended up getting there, right? He 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 got into foul trouble versus Wendy, Wimby. So at, at the end of the day, I'm going to tease it down to 10 in the same game, parlays and stuff like that. But, uh, you know, it is what it is, right? Um, Paulo, I mean, his rebounds and assists and play and points. So you can look at his PRAs in this spot. But like I said, um, the points for uh, Wendell Carter, I couldn't talk you off of it at 11 uh, or 12 and a half on FanDuel. On other books, you can get it for 11 and a half. DraftKings, Caesars, and uh, uh, BetMGM. I will shake it down to 10 and bankroll builders. So it is what it is, right? Uh, He's hit this number in six of his last 10 games. Head to head versus this team, he hit it uh, two of his last three games, right? Uh, hmm. Next game's going to be uh, the Dallas Mavericks. I haven't made my mind. I, I need to see who's going to be in and out of this game, right? If we don't get, if we don't get, uh, if we don't get, uh, Brunson, and you can, and Josh Hart could be on triple double watch or some shit straight up, For real double double at least. You know he can catch a, he can catch a double double in rebounds or assists. A uh, Minnesota Timberwolves and Milwaukee Bucks, right? Um, before I jump into this one, uh, interesting play here, right? Now, we all know how good of a defensive player, um, uh, um, uh, Rudy Gobert is, right? But centers that can pop that three. They do often shoot him versus him, right? Now, Brook Lopez, he's been out for personal reasons. He 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 just had four, five, and six threes in, in back-to-back games, right? But don't be surprised if he if he if he tries to bring um um if he tries to bring um um Rudy Gobert out tonight, you know, behind that three three ball. Uh, so it is what it is, right? And all the centers that shoot threes, they've been hitting them versus uh, Rudy Gobert. We just we just hit we just hit Wendell Carter threes versus him. We just hit uh, Vucevic threes versus him. And of course, uh, Lopez will be playing tonight. I, I can't see Lopez not playing tonight versus the Twin Towers. He plays tonight. Boom! I, I like them threes, right? Um, Anthony Edwards is in a good spot here. Um, Double double p uh, uh a double double uh parlay piece right here. I'll show you guys what I'm gonna put with this. So it's a double double parlay piece here. It's going to be uh Rudy Gobert, a uh, double double parlay piece. And um I'm gonna just keep it moving, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep my mouth shut. <laughs> um Cleveland Cavaliers at Brooklyn Nets, right? So um don't know the status of what, what's going to happen on this. This is a back-to-back, right? So I'll tell you this, right? Um, we've been going here all season long, right? We won for one in the last three games, two games for, uh, uh, for, uh, for the threes for Evan Mobley. Now, um, points on the season, points and threes, Brooklyn, right? They're giving up the most points and the most threes to the point guard position on the season, right? I'll be looking at Garland's threes again, right? I've already taken it, right? So I took top Garland threes. In fact, I took him at one and a half for like minus 105, and I took him at two and at two and a half for like plus 300, right? And I stopped right there. Well, that's all you, all you can go. I'm going right back to the well again, uh, plus 310 now, like. Right? Why wasn't it plus 310 when I went in? I got it at plus 300. Either way it go, non-official plays, but I'm gambling, right? So it is what it is, right? Um, if if uh, Mobley plays, he's back into a good spot again. Uh, he hoax smashed yesterday, had like 22 and 8. Uh, you can look at his points. You can look at his rebounds. You can look at his points plus rebounds. Um, but I'm probably just going to, you know, go, not go there, right? Um, ben Simmons. Ben Simmons has 
Yeah, he's got double, double, triple, double upside. So he's been flirting. So be on the lookout for that. Now, on the flip side, Darius Garland is not the greatest defender. He played 28 minutes along with, um, uh, along with, um, him and, uh, man, what's that boy's name, man? Him and, uh, Evan Mobley played 28 minutes. So, um, they 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 minutes are monitored, and like I said, it's a back to back. I don't I don't know, but like I said, uh, um, 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 Garland is not the greatest defender, man. So you know, you know, they, every nigga garbage can gets a stake, man. Um, shit, we, you, 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 uh, uh, that's a possibility that um. Then Whitty can pop off here, right? Then you got the assists. Um, Darren Garland, five and a half assists. I don't know, man. It's a lean. I might lean towards the over, but I ain't fucking with it, okay? Chicago Bulls, Memphis Grizzlies, right? So not 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 one of my favorite games here. But the other part of this uh parlay, I'll be going with uh a double double, right? Uh, Vucevic has a double double in three straight games versus this team. Uh, you can get Vucevic and Rudy Gobert double double for plus one hundred five. I'll, I'll 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 take that right. And then um, I'm gonna just keep it moving from this Bulls. Do what you do do what you like, right? I want to save some time. Utah Jazz at Phoenix Suns, right? So um, hey, I'm going right back to the well, man. I mean, I'm going, I, I didn't already bet it either way I go. I got a minus one hundred five. It's a minus one on four right now. Out of Texas, one and a half threes, right? So it is what it is, right? I, I took this one and a half threes. Um, one thing I will point out here, this was probably going to be the game, right? I'm I'm leaning towards this being the game. It's being the game, right? It's going to be the game. So I, I, I'm just going to leave you with this, right? Oh, man. Glory points ain't up. Hmm, interesting. I gotta go check his check the news. But I'm gonna leave you with this, right? Head to head. These last three games these two teams played, the score was 104 to 26. Then it was 131 to 128. That's 259. Then it was uh 140 to 137. That's two that's 237. I mean two um 77, right? They put up mega points in this one here. Um Booker went crazy. I mean, um, I don't know what Booker had. Uh, Durant went crazy. Um, off the bench, uh, Colin Sexton had 20, I believe, 19-20. Um, Marketing had about 30. So, man, you know what I'm saying? It, 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 it's going to be one, right? So, uh, let me talk you off anything from this game. Um, I'm leaning towards the over one and a half threes for Bradley Beal, too. Um, guards here, no, none of these backward players can, can probably guard each other. You know what I'm saying? So it's going to be crazy. Let me check this injury news real quick. I mean, yeah, this trade news real quick. Let's see. Gordon Hayward going to the Thunder. Ooh. Gordon Hayward going to the Thunder. Ooh. Then don't they need him? Ooh, don't they need him? They definitely do. Hmm. Who they get? What they get? Gotta check. Uh, gotta check. Uh, Chan. I got him on speed down. Trey Man and and David that Davis Bertans. Hmm. Charlie was trying to clean house. Charlie was trying to clean out. Another notification. Another one. Right. What's the Whatever. All right. So, um, and then that I think that sums it up, right? Um, listen. Oh no, it doesn't. Uh, the Detroit and um, this Detroit and um, a Portland Trailblazers game. I'm pausing on this one, man. I'm pausing. Shout out to Duran getting there for me last night for the double double with the minus one fifteen. Thank you, sir. Um, Denver Nuggets and Los Angeles Lakers. Look, 
it's all about, I ain't gonna say it's all about, but um, I like, uh, first and foremost, I like the five and a half rebounds, right? Um, probably six and a half on the books now, but uh, yeah, five and a half rebound for Michael Porter Jr. Man, I couldn't talk you off the rebounds for Aaron Gordon either, man. I might have to shake him down. I might have to shake him down, right? Let me see. I might have to shake him down, right? Let's see. I can get four and four right there. I mean, I might have to shake him down. I might have to do a back row builder here. Or put it with a couple other things, you know? And make about a six or seven leg for about plus two, three hundred, right? Either way it go. Um so I, I like the three ball here, right? I like the threes for uh, Jamal Murray and uh, LeBron James. I I mean uh, not LeBron James. I'm sorry, Jamal Murray and Michael Porter. Uh, both of these both of these guys, you know, shown the ability to hit the three, even uh, 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 in head to head matchups versus teams, respectful teams. Um, let's see. Even Nikola Jokic, uh, head to head versus these two teams here, um, he's hit a three in uh, a decent amount of games. A lot of these games were playoff games too, but you know it is what it is. He's seven and nine for the first of the threes in the playoffs. He was hitting two two threes and shit, right? But uh, he's seven and nine, you know, at least two or three. His three is, is set at a half at a parlay piece at uh one minus one seventy, right? Um, next, uh, Jamal Murray, uh, his threes, right? Um, his last ten games, he said he had three threes or better in six of his last ten games and head to head. Uh, he's hit three threes or better in six of his nine last nine games, right? Versus this team, right? So they have that. And then, um, and then, uh, Michael Porter Jr., right? Uh, his threes. Now, uh, he's five or ten to this number, uh, last ten games, and he's five or seven to this number versus this team, right? And we can also look at this, his rebounds, uh, versus this team. He's got seven. Uh, he, he's hit this number five and a half at seven out of his, his last seven games versus this team. Um, and then his last 10 games in general, uh, he's five or 10 to this number with a stretch of uh, four straight with five and a half rebounds, right? So um, that just about sums it up for me, man. Uh, might end up doing the same game parlay for that one. I like a few props there, right? I got love for Anthony Davis points and stuff like that. Um, but uh, going down the line, um, the official plays was going to be uh, what I've already sprinkled on. I took the threes for um, I took the threes for Garland. I took the double doubles for uh, for um, uh, parlay piece for uh, him uh uh uh, Gobert and uh Vucevic. The one and a half threes for um, Sexton, and it was something else. Oh, the uh, 12 and a half. Uh, I'm getting ready to sprinkle that right now. The 12 and a half points for uh, um, um, Wendell Carter. It's like a, I'm just going to keep on taking this points prop as long as they keep hitting it. It's not really an official play. I'm just riding that wave, right? Um, and then Lopez, man, I'm taking his threes if he play, okay? And then, you know, it is what it is, guys. Peace.